Throughout history, ingenious men have taken the things they had on hand, the tools they had on hand, and the materials, and made beautiful and wonderful things. Michelangelo took stone and a simple chisel and hammer and made beautiful, beautiful, wonderful sculpture. Leonardo da Vinci took uh, canvas and simple paint brushes and paint and painted beautiful pictures. Frank Lloyd Wright took everyday building materials and created structures, and buildings, and homes of great beauty. And locally, we have a farmer named Farmer Brown who has done much the same. Here's Farmer Brown and his wife. They live up north of here in the bottomland. They have a farm there next to the foot of a small mountain. And out in this pasture by the road, Farmer Brown has a bunch of big boulders and rocks. So having those on hand, Farmer Brown, being an ingenious man, created his rock zoo. And I'm going to take you on a tour of Farmer Brown's rock zoo. Now he cautions you not to feed his animals while you're in the zoo, as this sign is seen painted on the rock. And Farmer Brown is a patriotic man, as seen with this huge American flag that also is painted on a rock. So prepare now to enjoy the splendor of Farmer Bob's Rock Animal Zoo. As we walk through the gates, here's the first animal you see on the right. And here is a goose, a goose and a duck, rock goose, a rock duck. And of course everybody will recognize the rock elephant buried up in the grass. This is a, a white rock uh, with an eyeball. And this could be a, a rock calf or maybe a rock hound dog laid down in the bushes. This one is either a rock penguin or a rock goose. But notice the, the detail, the, the eyes of the, the penguin or goose are embedded marbles embedded back in this rock surface. Just paid fine attention to the detail. This one may be a goose also. It's uh, This one's a little questionable. Uh, no doubt what this one is. This is a huge big rock hen. This thing would weigh two tons. A huge rock hen. Beautiful work. And back over behind the hen you see a rock giraffe. And I'm going to zoom in on the rock giraffe so you can see the fine detail work. The paint work that we've done on this rock giraffe wonderful work. Hey, everybody knows this, a rock, a rock rabbit. And again, you notice the marble eyeballs, a little detail there. This is a rock land shark over in the grass with a seal there nearby. And if the seal doesn't watch out, he may be eaten by the land shark. And every farmer has got to have a rock watermelon in his rock zoo. And that's what you're seeing here, buried down in the grass. A rock goose a rock duck, maybe, with his head sticking up. And no zoo is complete without a green rock alligator. And here that is. This is a, is a, a platypus. You notice by the, the, the bill across the rock there. And this is the highlight of the, the zoo. It's a big rock rooster with a red comb and just fine detail work on the, the rock rooster. And here's some of the cows, a cow and a calf laying there in the grass painted up very nicely. I guess those are Holsteins. I, I don't remember my cows too well. And over by the cows was this rock porcupine. And out in front of the uh, the cows is uh, maybe a rock beaver. The thing with the red eyes there. And of course a green rock turtle. That was easy to, to identify. In the background, you see some of Farmer Bob's uh, farm equipment. A big rock frog. And again, notice notice the marble eyeballs embedded in the big rock frog. This, this may be a rock whale out in the grass there, out toward the barn. And of course, Farmer Bob, being a religious man, he wanted to get a little advertising in for his religion. And here is a rock figure and you can easily read what it says on this rock figure there on top of the, the rock. 
So that's your visit to Farmer Bob's Rock Zoo. I hope you've enjoyed it. And if you're ever in this location, I'm sure you want to put it on your travel plans to, uh, to visit uh, the Rock Zoo. And here's uh, Farmer Bob and his wife, at least scarecrows of them, bidding you a, a fond farewell after your visit to uh, the Rock Zoo. And there's Farmer Bob and his wife uh, Gladys.